Welcome to Mission San Gabriel. My name is Caitlin, and today I will be your tour guide. San Gabriel Mission was founded on September 8, 1771, by Father Junipero Serra. It was built by slaves from a nearby Indian village, Tongva. The materials used to build the mission are stone, brick, and mortar. This mission took 26 years to build. The church is the most important and honored room. This is where they have prayers, service, and rituals. Now we go to the cemetery. It holds the resting place of 6,000 California Indians and is the oldest cemetery in Los Angeles. Behind the church is a sacristy where the priest prepared for service and prayers. Past the priest's bedroom is the bell tower. They were run for telling time, marking both funerals and other special occasions. The largest bell weighed over a ton and was used for over a century. The bell rang date early in the morning to wake up the California Indians, and they head straight to the church for prayer and service. This is repeated in the evening. Next to the sacristy is the winery, where California Indians made olive oil and wine. They had the largest vineyard in Spanish California and was a source of many vines planted in other missions. This is the quad. The California Indians used this well for drinking, laundry, and cooking. Over 25,000 baptisms were made here, making this mission the most prolific mission within the 21. We are now at the living quarters where the California Indians slept and studied religion. Both boys and girls living quarters were very unsanitary and had no hygiene. Because of this, many Indians died of sickness and disease. This is the hall of different workshops. They specialize in candles, shoes, banners, paintings, soap, and carpets. In front of the workshops is the kitchen with an open fireplace where the women and girls spent most of their day preparing meals for several hundred people. The main food was a mush called a toll made from ground wheat or corn. Behind the kitchen is the garden, which includes the beautiful fountain. Behind the workshops is a large farm that the mission is known for having the most production. There were wheat beetroots, carrots, and potatoes. The mission herded 42,350 cattle and harvested over 353,000 bushels of produce. Even though the Spanish made 21 missions to spread religion, some Native Americans lived in fear and were forced to follow the rural religion and work the land. Due to limited time, I can only give you a brief overview of my mission and would welcome you to visit. Let me know if you are interested and I can give you access. Thank you for listening.